The mission of the school at Hogg Lunatic Center is to prepare our students for the real world. And we call them future ready skills. This is where they can be creative, they can be critical thinkers, they can communicate to collaborate. Our students deserve the best. That's why I'm always researching what I can find for our students. As we look at interactive displays, it really allows the classroom to evolve. The future of technology in a classroom, it's about getting the kids out of their seats, collaborating, where if you've got interactive displays, you can break your kids into groups. They're having more fun and want to come to class. I was just super impressed with the way Hog New Tech Center is forward thinking and put multiple Samsung interactive displays in each of his classrooms. We have 33 interactive displays in our school and roughly there's one in each classroom. In a couple classrooms, we actually have three interactive displays, two 75s side by side, and then a 65 interactive display that is on wheels. And we have two of the 75 inch in our library space. Before we had the interactive displays, we primarily use document cameras and overhead projectors. It wasn't practical or easy to use. On the interactive displays, I can easily access the internet or cast my computer to them. I can find all of my instructional material. The engagement and collaboration has really improved. Students are a lot more interactive with the learning and when I introduce new skills, they're excited about it and they want to participate and they're a lot more motivated to really work out to the best of their abilities. These interactive displays, I think, really give the students the opportunities for them to express themselves in different ways. For example, they'll take a picture of a word problem with the Samsung tablet. They'll display it on the interactive display. And while one student is solving that word problem on the interactive display, the rest of the students are solving that same problem in their notebook. And they'll have a discussion whether they agree with the answer or not. Certain students are more quiet and the board allows them to show their creativity. And we have some really cool tools on the board. Obviously you can annotate on it, but you, you can also paint and you can do oil paint or watercolors. And it's really amazing what some of the kids have been able to do with that. The Samsung interactive displays, they're so practical, they're so easy to use, and the kids love using them. What really drives what we do here with our interactive displays, we are preparing our kids for jobs that don't exist. How do we allow them to be creative with their content? How do we allow them to communicate, collaborate, and quickly think? So if we can do that, then I know that they're ready for now, the present, and for the future.